Hello everyone, and this is James McDaniels. You are listening to the NBA and NASCAR Power Half Hour. I am your host, and we've got another great show on tap for you guys today. Um, I know it's been a little while since I've done a show. Um, last show I tried to do, there were some technical difficulties with the sound, and you couldn't hear anything, so I canceled that show. Um, I've been taking a break the last uh, few weeks, but now that summer's here, I'm going to start doing a lot more uh, shows again. In fact, I'm going to be doing two shows every week. This show that I currently have, plus I'll add another show that will uh, I'll be going over all the other stuff that's happening in all the other sports. Um, so that's the schedule for this year, so you'll be seeing me a lot more. And this is pretty much the start of my summer series on here on this network. Like everybody else, they're flocking uh, national sports with all their sports shows. So it's going to be a blast here on national sports, and I'm hoping to get a lot of columns. I'll start adding uh, the number to call in so people can actually call into the show, and then that can take up some time so I can try to keep my half an hour uh, going so I can do two half-hour shows and not bring them both down to 15 minutes. So I'm going to have today, actually, as a guest, I'm going to have Robert Dieters. Of course, Robert, he is one of the big guys on this uh, sports show site, National Sports. He's one of the main guys that runs it. So it's always great to hear from him. We're going to talk to him pretty much all NBA today. Um, we're going to go from finals to Jason Kidd to uh, the Clippers, um, their head coaching situation. So he'll be on with me in about three minutes here while I'm catching him on his work break. Um so until then, um, I'll tell you what we're going to go through all today. So like I just said, we're going to go through the playoffs. Uh, we're going to go through Jason Kidd a little bit, his retirement, his new job in the NBA. Talk about Jason Kidd's career, basically, how big it was, and uh, kind of what history he made. Was it successful or not? We're going to talk about some news that's been related to uh, Scotty Pippen. Um, he's been in the news lately, but not for good reason. So we'll tell you about that. And I'll also tell you guys all about my uh, VIP experience to Infineon Raceway, or Sonoma Raceway, I should say, for the uh, last NASCAR race on Sunday. Um, Sonoma is the closest track to where I am, and through a friend we were able to get um, big old uh, VIP passes, and we were able to get down the pits, and uh, pits, and a luncheon, and great seats, and turn two, if you know the configurations of Infineon. So I'll tell you guys all about my experience in this uh, half an hour, or hopefully can be a half an hour broadcast, I'm going to have so much on this uh, broadcast, I might well go over my uh, half an hour without even trying. Um, and uh, I'll just point one thing out here on NASCAR before we uh, go, is that um, if you're a Hem Hendrick fan, it was a pretty good day at Sonoma, um, as all four Hendrick drivers finished well in the top 20. In fact, I believe all of them finished within the top 12 actually um, after all of them finished really really bad last week um, at Michigan so I just wanted to bring that up just in case any of you were kind of wondering you know how the Hendrick guys did at a uh, at of course they pretty much dominate at Jimmy Johnson and Jeff Gordon do after they've won so many times at road courses um, so I'll just bring up that fact very quickly so I'll go a little bit more over the Sonoma race as uh, we get ready to go on uh, with Robert here in a minute so I actually got to uh, call Robert and he'll be picking up immediately so um, I'm going to go to a commercial break right now um, and then when we get back I will have Robert with me on the line and we're gonna talk all that NBA stuff that I said we're gonna talk about so uh, yeah see you guys after the break Robert will be on and uh, this you are listening to the NBA and NASCAR power half hour with your host James uh, McDaniels here, and um, actually, there is no, there is, there. oh wait, there is no commercial button, ah oh, crap, I didn't realize that there was not one. 